If you're looking for all natural bath and body care here in Milton, you're gonna wanna check out today's video. Hi, I'm Shalini Enriquez with Remax Real Estate Center. I live in Milton, I work in Milton, and I absolutely love sharing the things that I love about our community with all of you. Today, I'm at the Lala Soap Company here on Charles Street. Thank you so much for having me in today. Tell me a little bit about Lala Soap Company. Well, my name is Lori Taylor, and I'm the creative director and founder of Lala Soap Company. Uh, we're located in Milton, Ontario. We're actually in the heart of downtown. And uh, we found this location for our Green Beauty Wellness Boutique and Massage Therapy Studio. Um, so, yeah, welcome. We opened in April of 2018, and uh, my husband and I were both RMTs in Milton. Uh, he's been in practicing in Milton for almost 23 years, oh, wow. and uh, I've been here for 13. And so an opportunity uh, for us to combine our massage therapy practices and the La La Soap um, in a retail environment so that people could have uh, everything under one roof. I started making soap back in 97. Mm -hmm. um, I worked in um, Vancouver while I was going to massage therapy college out there. And uh, I worked for an aromatherapy company and where they make handmade natural products that were all aromatherapy based, and that included soap. And they used to send soap home to my mom in Ontario because she couldn't use commercial brand products. And uh, when I moved back to Ontario, I, I jokingly said to my dad, who was retired, you know, we should make soap for mom. Uh, I had two months until I could practice massage therapy and to wait to write my board exams. And uh, he said, sure. So I ended up researching how to make soap. It's all cold process. So uh, my parents, uh, being Italian, had a separate canning kitchen. And the uh, kitchen was a perfect space for them to, like for my dad to actually make the soap. It was just a little hobby where he would make soap. I would have everything shipped to him. And he, I would call him up and I would say, okay, I need you to make uh, three batches of this or two batches of that. And he actually created all the molds out of wood. Mm -hmm. um, and we still use those today. So it's been over 20 years. We're still using these same wooden molds. Um, and everything is hand cut and as well as uh, handmade. Oh, wow. I love coming in here. The last time I was in here, we picked up the uh, the natural deodorant for, for my daughters, yeah. right? What are some of your really popular items that you that you saw? So one of the products that's really that's done very well for us is the muscle recovery blend. So having an aromatherapy background, uh, what's advantageous is that uh, when I create all my blends, I blend for purpose, not just for scent. So it's for both. So it needs to smell appealing to the customer so that they will use it. But at the same time, it has to have function. And being an aromatherapist, I have the knowledge um, so that I can actually put things purposefully together. Um, the Muscle Recovery is an actual aromatherapy blend that I've created. It has oils of camphor, rosemary, marjoram, peppermint, lavender um, amongst others and uh, so when I created the soaking bath salts um, normally as an RMT we will tell clients you know you need to take a soak in the tub use Epsom salts and one to two cups per bath which is quite a lot of salt um, when I created the soaking bath salts I decided to cut the Epsom using dead sea salts and dead sea salts are known for their um, really they're very beneficial for rheumatism any type of skin conditions um, so it really is people who travel around the world to go to the Dead Sea to actually be healed so by adding Dead Sea salts in combination with Epsom and the essential oils what it does is it creates um, a, a product that actually people can use a lot less of so uh, another part of me is very much about value for customers so I want um, people to be able to integrate these products into their everyday life so that it's not something that they can only buy once because it's too costly so um, with this type of product you're gonna get four to six baths out of one tub which is really economical and then to take it a step further since we've opened the retail shop we offer many of our really popular products in bulk so if you save the container um, you can bring the container back, 
refill it and you'll save 10% on anything that we have in stock that can be refilled. Oh, so great. it's also environment. It's great for the environment, it's sustainable, it's low waste, um, and it's economical. Awesome. Another one of the products you're gonna tell me about is oh, this yes. one here, right? Yes, yeah, so our in the clear um, massage and body roll-on. So this is a roll-on bottle. It's made with pure essential oils, uh, and the base of it is jojoba oil. So jojoba is a liquid wax. Our product in the clear uh, was designed with uh, for people that have cold or flu or seasonal allergies in mind. So it's made with essential oils of tea tree, thyme, ravensera, lavender, and eucalyptus. So they help you to open up your sinuses. Um, it's great for um, basically helping that post nasal drip. Uh, you put it on your feet, put it on your neck where the lymphatic, like where your lymph nodes are. And what it does is it actually helps things to open up and it makes you breathe easier. Nice. That's like, especially we're coming into flu season, right? Yeah, so this is a perfect be... product for getting into flu season, cold and flu season. Um, if you want to dispel germs, this is a great one. This is my, this is a go-to at our house with the kids. Uh, they put it on their feet. Um, they put it on their neck if they feel like they have uh, something coming on. And um, overnight, there is an immediate difference. Their uh, post nasal drip disappears. Their dry cough will disappear, um, and they, you can use it as often as needed. Yeah, and we also sell this blend um, by the, we sell all our essential oils by the drop, so you can get this blend for your diffuser. We have it in a uh, room and body spray, and uh, you can even use it. It's we have one of our shower steamers, so you can uh, put it in your shower if you want to have um, an at home spa experience, uh, especially that if you're not feeling really well. Nice. <laughs> Now we're in the Your Creations This is the DIY show. section. Okay. So this is sort of our education area where people can come and learn. We offer different types of workshops uh, where you can come and create your own skincare to um, any kind of first natural first aid products. Okay. Um, we do bath bomb making parties. Uh, we have a party called Mix It Up where you can create, it's more like team based. Um, but essentially what you can do here is we have over 40 essential oils, all pure essential oils, and we sell all our essential oils by the drop. Yeah. So what you're going to do is you get to choose a product that you want to customize. So did you want, what did you want to make today? I guess a, like a lotion? Yeah. So we have the, so we've got a bottle of a uh, hand and body lotion. Okay. okay. Um, and then we can always try to pull it together and see if we can find a blend that you might want to create. Okay. Jasmine sounds good. I'm going to give this one a smell. That smells really nice. There's yeah. something about like smelling those, right? Like that's yeah. just, it feels immediately. Well, like essential oils, they, because they trigger different parts of the, um, the limbic system, which mm -hmm. is part of your brain. So when you smell it, it goes right to your brain. Yeah. So it can have a, effects, uh, trigger different emotions. People are like, well, they like, you know, they're, you know, apple pie or baking bread, or things like that can take They're you comfort. back for a moment. Right. right. Yeah. yeah. And if we could just bottle those, unfortunately, some of those aromas aren't available as essential oils, but you can have the spices, right? Yeah. Like the cinnamon, the yes. clove. Yeah. Um, that's why at Christmas time, it's really nice. We do a beautiful blend called mistletoe kiss and it's yeah. cinnamon, clove, blood orange and bergamot. So it's like those oranges, those clementines where you would add the uh, cloves to yeah, yeah, yeah. or you can like just have like mulled cider like it's just got that beautiful uh, scent. Lavender is one of those oils it's calming in low doses but it's stimulating in high doses. Oh. So if you ever want to use lavender at night, yeah. make sure you're only using one or two drops. Okay. Don't use like the whole five or six <laughs> or ten drops because what that will do is it'll actually keep you up. It'll it becomes a stimulant. Oh, that's good to know. Yeah. I did not know that. <laughs> and I'm like, mm -mm -mm. yeah, no. <laughs> Less is more when it comes to aromatherapy. This is nice. I don't know. I've no even know what this is. Neroli. Neroli is orange blossom. So again, it's one of the oh rare precious gosh, oils like really Jasmine. Nice. It's beautiful and it's great for stress relief. Oh, so, maybe that's why. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Take it all in. I think these two are so, speaking to me the most. So you like the more expensive oil. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's put them together. So I'm just okay. going to show you when, when, and you like lavender too, right? Yeah, so we're yeah. going to throw the lavender in there because I'll have you smell just these two together now. Okay. Mm. See how it changes mm. the scent? Mm. Okay. And now I'm going to add lavender and okay. I want to see what you think with the lavender added to it. 
I can smell the lavender more out of all of the, all of the three. All it of the takes three. over, right? Yeah, yeah. So when you're creating a blend, you have to keep that in mind. So if the lavender seems like really strong when we put them together, we can put less of the lavender if you want it in there. Yeah. And focus more on these two, I think right? these two. You just want yeah, to add yeah. these two? Okay, they smell perfect. Right together. Awesome. So. It's fun. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's yeah. yummy. That's very really good. So now I'm gonna have you add the drops to your okay. bottle. So okay. what you're gonna do is I'm gonna just take out the stick. Okay. And so we said this is eight ounces. You wanna add three drops per ounce, which is a total of 24. Okay. Um, you like them pretty much equally, mm -hmm. I'm guessing. Yeah. So you're gonna just do 12 drops of each. Okay. Okay. So when you add them, you just don't want the dropper to touch the lid. And you just wanna hold it on an angle. Yeah, okay, you just like wanna this. hold it up a little higher. Yeah, and okay. then just turn it, keep going, yeah until it seems like it's gonna come out, just not vertical. Yeah, okay, just, am I good? Yeah, and you just have to be patient because okay. some of these oils are a little bit more viscous. Uh, I see. Okay, here we go, one. Okay, and then you're gonna add your second one. Okay, Same and then thing. again, 12? Yep, add okay. 12. This one's the jasmine, right? Mm -hmm. oh, I really like and this. And then what we're gonna do is, <laughs> once you're done, we'll shake it up. Okay. And then you'll open it up and see if it's, number one, if it's strong enough, if you like the balance, and then we can tweak it from there. Oh yeah, that one came out a lot quicker. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so the viscosity is different depending mm -hmm. on the oil. So I'm just gonna pop that back in. Okay. And give it a good shake. Okay. You do a cleaning products too, right? Did you read that? Yeah, we're gonna be doing a workshop um, in January. Okay. And it's make your own natural cleaning products. So um, there will be a multi-purpose cleaner, um, a pots and pans scrub, and a carpet and mattress um, oh, that's good. Uh, cleaner. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna sign up for that. Yeah, that it would will be, be really a, fun. I'd like to do that. Yeah, for sure. That's awesome. Okay, so let's give this. You can smell this guy. Let's okay. See. It smells really nice. Is that good? Yeah, I like it. That's strong enough for you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's good. Perfect. Yeah, yeah. Light, then, light, light scent, right? On, yeah. the, on the lotion. I, I yeah. really like it. Perfect. Yeah. So then all you need to do is add a label and uh, think of a fun name that you oh, want to call it. Oh my goodness. And you can personalize it. Oh, that's Put stickers fun. on it if I'm you want. I'm gonna call it and check it out, Milton. <laughs> there we go. My Milton Yay. blend. Not only does La La Soap carry beautiful bath and body products, they also have this gorgeous jewelry. They have intention bracelets and necklaces. Lala Soap is a real gem in downtown Milton. And if you haven't been yet, you should definitely go and check them out. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Be sure to check out Lala Soap Company on Instagram and Facebook, and I'm gonna put a link to both of their accounts here. And we'll see you next week, Milton. Thank you.